Hi, welcome to Buzzy Canada channel. In this video, we will talk about 2021 Canada Parents and Grandparents Sponsorship Program, which is also referred as PGP. Canada's Parents and Grandparents PGP, program is unique in the world. It gives families the chance to reunite here, providing them the opportunity to thrive in this country. Family reunification plays a significant role in attracting, retaining, and integrating immigrants who contribute to our success as a country. Building on the success of the PGP program in recent years, the Honorable Marco E. L. Mendicino, Minister of Immigration, Refugees, and Citizenship, today announced that Immigration, Refugees, and Citizenship Canada, IRCC, will invite a record number of people to apply under the 2021 intake of the program. IRCC will accept up to 40,000 additional applications, giving more Canadians and permanent residents than ever before the opportunity to bring their loved ones to Canada. Following this, the Immigration Department randomly selected 10,000 potential sponsors in January 2021. IRCC said that a further 30,000 applicants would be invited later in the year, again using the same lottery process. Those who expressed an interest to sponsor in 2020, but were not invited to apply, may be considered in the upcoming PGP 2021 lottery draw. This will give additional interested sponsors the opportunity to bring their parents and grandparents to Canada. Invitations to apply will be sent over the course of two weeks, starting the week of September 20, 2021. IRCC strongly encourages candidates to ensure the information they submitted on IRCC's website last autumn remains up to date, including your contact details. Those invited to apply as part of this process will be able to use our new permanent resident digital intake tool, which allows applications to be submitted electronically. This is part of their commitment to modernize Canada's immigration system and will speed up and simplify the application process. Many Canadian families have experienced financial difficulties in the last year because of the pandemic. For this reason, they are trying to implement a more facilitative income requirement to ensure that more people can apply. For the 2020 tax year, the income requirement will continue to be the minimum necessary income instead of the minimum necessary income plus 30%, and will allow regular employment insurance benefits and temporary COVID-19 benefits, such as the Canada Emergency Response Benefit, to be included towards the sponsor's income. This measure will ensure that applicants are not penalized for losing income during the pandemic. Key eligibility factors for the PGP. PGP sponsorship applicants must be 18 years of age or older, Canadian citizens, permanent residents, or status First Nations and have the means to support the family member they are sponsoring. Sponsors must also prove that they have sufficient income to support all family members for whom they will be financially responsible, including themselves, once they become sponsors. All applicants are therefore encouraged to check how much money they will need to support the number of people for whom they will be financially responsible before submitting an application to the PGP. The minimum necessary income MNI is a key eligibility factor for the PGP. IRCC will assess each sponsor's MNI for the 2020, 2019, and 2018 tax years. This proof of necessary income is only to be provided after interest in sponsorship has been expressed via the online form. However, applicants who are selected and invited to apply and who do not meet the MNI requirement will see their application refused. Due to the coronavirus pandemic, IRCC will assess your MNI only for the 2020 tax year, but it will not assess the usual MNI plus 30 percenter. In addition, applicants can count employment insurance, EI, benefits and the Canada Emergency Response Benefit, CERB, towards their MNI for the 2020 tax year. Sponsors residing outside of the Canadian province of Quebec who are invited to apply and their co-signers, if applicable, will have to provide notices of assessment from the Canada Revenue Agency, CRA, for each of the three aforementioned taxation years. 
Rather than the three-year income requirement set for the rest of Canada, Quebec requires that potential sponsors and their co-signer, if applicable, demonstrate that they have had sufficient financial resources available to them in the last 12 months to support their family unit. Individuals who wish to sponsor a parent or grandparent and who live in Quebec have their income assessed by Quebec's Immigration Ministry, based on the province's income requirements. Both IRCC and the Government of Quebec require a signed undertaking from interested sponsors. This undertaking sets out how long the sponsor will be financially responsible for the family members they are sponsoring from the time they become permanent residents of Canada. The length of the undertaking for parents and grandparents is 20 years for residents of all Canadian provinces except Quebec. For residents of Quebec, the duration of that commitment is 10 years. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos.